Hey, good morning, everybody. How we doing out there? Uh, hopefully, you're doing well, and uh, you're, you and your family are well. Get ready to head on down the line and check some traps. Um, <clears throat> got a few of them. Uh, not many, but we've got uh, I think 12. I got 12 sets out, and she has two, two sets and a snare. And a snare. <laughs> I have two snares, to be exact. Um, <laughs> So uh, we're gonna go check them and uh, yeah, see what we come up with. Uh, those of you who don't know, we're up to uh, 11 coyotes now. So uh, God's been blessing us. Um, so that's what we're gonna do here. But uh, before we do that, um, those of you, this is that point in the video, if you watch my videos, um, if you don't like God being mentioned and you don't like prayer and you don't like that sort of thing jump ahead about a minute a minute two minutes something like that and we'll be in the trapping again <clears throat> um, but for those of you who do like that sort of thing uh, we're gonna have a Bible verse and pray and we're gonna get on down the line then so uh, here we go all right Proverbs 16 25 there is a path before each person that seems right but it ends in death so, in the end, it doesn't matter who you are, you better make sure you're right with God, because we're all going to die. We all hit that point. Um, you know, it's a guarantee. That's one guarantee we have in life, that uh, we're all going to die, and you better be right with God. If, and if you don't believe in God, and don't believe in that sort of thing, um, you know, I encourage, I, I encourage you to rethink that. What do you, uh, if, if I am right, wouldn't you rather be on the the side that, it, that you know your life is right with Christ and you would uh, spend eternity with him? Or would you rather just take a chance and, uh, say maybe maybe not and end up uh, in hell what do you have to lose yeah I mean just something to think about just something uh, something you might want to think about but anyways uh, we're gonna pray here and we're gonna get on down the line <clears throat> dear Lord we just thank you and praise you for this wonderful day and uh, for all you do for us your blessings on us every day Lord just uh, there's someone out there that's watching this that's um, on the borderline of whether he wants to trust Christ or she wants to trust Christ or not. Um, would you just speak to them and work in them? And those of you, those who are out there that uh, are like, whatever, doesn't matter to me, just open their eyes, work in their heart, Lord. And uh, bless all those out there watching. Be with their families and bless them and guide them. And... Uh, we thank you for all you do and what you're going to do in our lives. And we ask these things in the name of Christ Jesus, our Savior. Amen. So, I just want to say something real quick. Remember one thing. The fence is the enemy's. So if you're sitting on the fence, you're still on the wrong side. And if anybody ever needs prayers, you can reach out to us at prayers at treyerwilderness.com or you can leave them in the description below. We don't need the details. If it's personal stuff, you don't need to share that. All you need to say is, I could use prayer, and we would be happy to lift you. And we would also be happy to share the gospel with you if you are on the fence and need more information. So never hesitate to reach out to us. All right, guys, well, here we go. Can you hit that? I can hit the button. I can't with it. Well, guys, um, <clears throat> nothing today. Uh, these sets, I, I think, are going to be sitting here for a little bit till we get some moving back through again. Um, yeah, there's no sign. I, yeah, but there, I, I don't know. I have some other stuff going on, so uh, I'm not going to be setting a bunch of sets, more sets, out. So I'm, it's just not going to work. I mean, I have about a almost a week here but I got so much stuff I gotta gotta do before then that it's not gonna it's not gonna work but uh, 
Um, little tip for those out there that might be getting into uh, trapping or if you've trapped for years even. Um, if you're thinking about going to using wax dirt when it's freezing, thawing, just flat out freezing and stuff and you're thinking about doing wax dirt, go for it. Um, I'm truly convinced that's the way to go as far as uh, keeping your sets working through winter. Uh, so if you're if you're on the fence there, what you're gonna do as far as uh, if you'd like to use wax dirt or not, if it's worth it or not, um, go for it. You won't be disappointed. You won't be, so. Well guys, I guess uh, take care and God bless and we'll catch you on the next one. Later.